So back on video 220, I talked about a way to integrate uh, intelligently an IVO prop into the electronics of the Speedwino in the uh, airplane. And uh, because I can't work on anything right now till after this weekend's over because of the holidays and people coming here being in my way, I worked on this instead. So um, I came up with uh, this, that if I use a 59.46 inch three blade IVO prop, and if I did something else magical, I'm not going to disclose right now, to get 43.44 horsepower at 4,400 RPM out of the engine, then all of this would happen right here, okay? And uh, so we end up with 275 pounds of thrust on takeoff, 57 miles an hour. And uh, then as you start pulling the throttle back, the uh, software-controlled system automatically repitches the propeller. So this is like a map table for fuel. This would be a map table for the IVO prop. And uh, so it'll automatically adjust the pitch at all these RPM settings. You don't have to do it. And uh, then we end up with this maximum FAA speed right here. We hit the FAA speed limit. So we take off and then we start pulling the throttle back. And uh, you see up here, I've just arbitrarily said, well, you should probably only run it. This is because the cylinder pressures are up pretty high right here, uh, beyond 4,000. So I would only run it a minute there. And so then after you get up in the air after a minute, then you probably want to pull it back to uh, uh, 4,000, anywhere between 3,700 and 4,000. That gets you 195 to 227 pounds of thrust for a nice, slow climb out to altitude. Um, and this could be uh, three minutes or five minutes. I have no idea. I arbitrarily said one minute. Uh, you know, you, you'll have a lot more climb out with these thrust numbers up here. But anyhow, um, that's all to be flight tested to figure out what to do there. But then after you get up to uh, altitude, um, you'll notice that it keeps uh, adding pitch even though you're decreasing horsepower and the speed is going up the entire time that you're slowing the engine down the airplane's going faster which is why you use an IVO prop and then we get down here and we actually hit the FAA maximum speed limit right here for uh, from 3400 to 3600 but if you look at the available horsepower uh, 3600 you're still you know we're fully loading the engine up from 3600 to 4400 so as you pull it back you know you get down here at about 3400 rpm and uh, we've got a little bit of horsepower left over that we're not using, which means we're not uh, taxing the engine 100% there. So according to this, we pull the engine back to 3,400. We'd be flying at maximum FAA speed with a thrust 164 pounds. Well, this plane's taking off with 180, so 164 should be plenty for level flight. Um, you know, and then you can actually slow it down even more. And probably, I just arbitrarily, based on thrust numbers, said uh, you're probably going to start descending here at 128 pounds of thrust. So, from here to here, uh, you can actually pull the engine back to 3,300, 3,200, 3,100 and probably maintain level flight. Heck, it might even do it at 3,000, but on the safe side, I just said 3,100. Uh, that's why I put all this stuff over here. So anyhow, this, uh, this looked pretty good on paper, and it matches up with the software, what the software says the engine could do, and the propeller calculation software. All of this would have to be flight tested and tuned in to make it work, but this will kind of give you a rough idea of why. Uh, having an in-flight controlled propeller, it changes everything about how your plane flies. I mean, if we're running the maximum FAA airspeed, 55 knots at 3,400, the fuel burn at that at that RPM is 12.2. That's at 100% too, and we're not at 100%, but it's 12.2 uh, pounds per hour. That's uh, 2.45 hours times... What's the airspeed of 55? 63.4? That's 155 mile range, although you burn some up on takeoff. Uh, so that's pretty good range. <laughs> okay. All right, so anyhow, that's what I'm doing now because I can't actually touch and work on anything. The plane can't be moved to the middle of the floor and put the wings on until these people get out of here tomorrow. All right, so that's it.